Hello, my name is Bernard Seal. I'm here today to share some advice. Whether work is taken into consideration or not is on you guys. Coming into high school, I don't know what to expect, but I know that it will fly by in the blink of an eye. And to my expectation, it's exactly how it felt. I didn't realize opportunities that faced me because throughout my years, all I was thinking of was pushing through the year to move on to the next, which was a mistake I wish I could take back, but can't. It isn't necessarily bad because even though I may not have participated in many extracurriculars, I did meet some pretty great people. And essentially, I feel that is what makes high school so great. Not what we are involved in, but the people we share those moments with. That is what I believe should be valued. My advice is to have an open mind and always be positive because then you can attract good energy and that can then lead to good things. I have my parents to thank for always being my number one supporters no matter the situation. I appreciate them so much for that. And on another note, I have my friends to thank. Without them, I don't even think I'd be the person I am today. I truly appreciate every single one of you, and I wish you guys nothing but good fortune moving forward. Hey Bulldogs, as you know, it's me, Mikhail, and I'm running to be your homecoming king. Of course, not everyone knows me, so let me tell you a little bit about myself. My name is Mikel Aquiles Escobar, and I made lots of memories here at West Covina High School. Here at the school, I've been involved in many activities such as being Vice President of AAAC, Secretary of CSF, Secretary of Multimedia in ASB, Basketball, and many more things. From all these activities, I made many new friends as well as notable memories, which I'm truly thankful for. High school has gone by so quick, and I did not even realize it until my senior year. From high school football games to the homecoming or winter formal dances, I'm going to miss it all. These past four years have been a roller coaster with ups and downs, but despite the low moments, I'm happy to say that I'm proud of what my overall high school experience has been. I want to give a big shout out to all my friends and family that have been there for me and supported me over all four of these years. Also, thank you to the teachers that I've had who've taught me many things other than the typical high school curriculum. When I first stepped foot onto the West Covina High School campus, I felt at home. That was no surprise considering my family chose West Covina as their home since we immigrated here from Vietnam 17 years ago. From joining choir and leadership my first year in high school to being taken out at the end of the year from a life-threatening heart surgery, this experience has truly been like no other. Because of West Covina High School, I know what it takes to enact change and bring generosity and compassion with every decision I make. And because of West Covina High School, I've had an immense amount of opportunities to further my education using the resources at this school to receive a full ride Crestbridge scholarship to Claremont McKenna College. But whether I'm in Claremont for the next four years or across the country, it is without a doubt that what I have learned from West Covina has pushed me on a path leading to the rest of my life. The city is my heart and the school is the blood that pumps through it. So melodrama aside, I know this year has been tough, especially for seniors, but we're gonna get through it and be stronger than we were before. Thank you guys. I remember the start of freshman year with the thoughts of where I wanted to be and how I would get there clouded my mind. It was when I let go of the past, stopped trying to predict the overwhelming future and built a present vision that my true ambitions fell into place. I am grateful for my involvement in four different sports and several school events because not only was I able to fulfill my competitive nature, but I was also allowed to perform and showcase my talents to the school. What I'll miss the most about West Covina High School are the people I have bonded with, as through the ups and downs of friendships, I have developed into a better version of myself as each experience brings a lesson. Given that high school was a learning ground, I am thankful for the wisdom it brought. First, I'd like to thank God for guiding me through another chapter of my life. Another shout out to my family for supporting me and caring for me. And lastly, a big shout out to the boys for being a part of a shared journey with countless memories on and off campus. I am Sergio Castillo. Yo, what's up Bulldogs? It's Randy, and I'm ready to be your homecoming king. As my time at West Covina High School comes to an end, I wanted to reflect on some of the best times of my life so far. At West Covina High School, I've met some amazing people. 
some of them becoming very close friends of my own. From the countless hours in the gym practicing with my teammates, or even the late night workshops with ASB. These experiences I will never forget. I'll never forget all of the club meetings and small club events that I've been a part of on campus. CSF, SAFE, NHS, and more. And most importantly, I'll never forget the little moments that made high school great, like the daily conversations with my friends at lunch. Although there's been ups and downs, I'm proud of my high school experience. With that being said, Thank you to everyone who made my high school experience something to not only remember, but to cherish. From friends to the staff and teachers, I appreciate you all.